With the new school year just around the corner, parents and kids are getting ready to adjust to the new classrooms, new teachers, new environment. So joining us live this morning to talk about all of that, how to make the transition really smooth, Elise McGregor from the Little Newton's Early Education Center. We have all kinds of different age groups to talk about. Yes, we do. So let's go ahead and begin with the little, the little guys, toddlers. What do you tell them and how does that end up working out, trying to transition them back into a classroom. You know, toddlers is probably the hardest transition because now they have separation anxiety and whether they've been home with a nanny or something at a baby age and then going into toddlers, it's very important to stay consistent. It's almost like everything has to be absolutely the same every single morning. What they have for breakfast, how they come into school, keeping that very consistent can really help the child to get their routine down. All right, and that probably applies too to like preschool and pre-K and all different age groups, yeah. right? Okay, so then the next step up would going, be going to preschool, like yep. three-year-olds, four-year-olds, right? Yes, and the, the thing about this age is they can express their emotions. Oh, yes. They can talk <laughs> to parents about things that they're feeling, and it's very important for parents to recognize that and allow them to talk about their emotions and not just, no, it'll be fine, actually listen to what they're nervous about or what they're scared about, and they can draw a picture, you know, for their teacher the next day so that it gives them something like an icebreaker to talk to their teacher about. All right, how about kindergarten? garden. That's a very exciting big step. It's and such a big day. I want to go to my little five-year-old nephew's first day of kindergarten on Monday, but it's really an entourage of us, so I'm a little concerned because, you know, when you have ten people, eight people going, that could be overwhelming, couldn't it, for a, for a little guy like that? Yeah, and the first day of kindergarten is very overwhelming, and what we do at Little Newtons is we, we teach them how to be in school so that when they do go to school, they don't have to worry about what that day looks like. They're ready to learn. They're ready to sit for group, and it's really a smooth transition. So what can you do? Because you know, and I have seen this before, going to other first days of kindergarten, there are always those little kids who are so traumatized, who are crying, and the parents just don't want to let go because you feel terrible, and you have to kind of like have that separation and make it happen. How do you make that moment better is there a way it is on the parent side is the children can feel your emotions and they can feel your stress and anxiety and as a parent going in this is exciting this is your first day and keep reiterating that the child will pick up on the parents I guess confidence if the parents just as nervous as a child oh, or if you're a nervous wreck right? yeah, it's just <laughs> those are the ones that it keeps building up and there's a lot more kind of pull to get the child away you really have to fake it then if you're you really nervous and your stomach's going like this and you're about to drop you're gonna off, be okay yeah you're gonna be okay as well as your child too yes. all right elementary age you know this is a funny age because all summer they've been able to sleep in they've stayed up late and it's important to kind of move their bedtime back back to 15 minutes every day to get them some sleep before they start to school. That's the biggest biggest thing is sleep. The biggest adjustment is just making sure their time schedule yes. is organized. Yeah, because that, could be, that could be really difficult. Like, okay, time to go to bed now. Yeah, after a summer of a lot of play. After a summer of fun, exactly. Yeah. Thank you so Thank much. You. A lot of fun things to talk about. So for more information on making that smooth transition, head on over to our website, abc7chicago.com. Hopefully some of that was helpful to you, too. I have to like think about this first day of kindergarten. Excellent suggestion on maybe I go the second day.